Guys, it finally happened. Me and the boys, we're finally off the leash. Watch out, society. I'm no longer bound by the strict rules and ethics of a college campus. Who knows what I'm gonna do in this 17 square foot apartment that I'm paying about $3,000 a month for. Guys, it's true. All right, I'm in an apartment now with three other guys, and I realize none of you guys have gotten a tour of the new place yet. That's insane, and I'm sure you've all been waiting for it. I've even gotten a few DMs and emails from, I assume, you guys about my new place like this one and this one and this one I love my fans anyway tour you look like that guy from stranger things has hey, anyone hey, ever told you that? Hey. <laughs> let's do a, a quick apartment tour bro we're finally in a real home so this is Ben's room oh that's his little corner and then this is his he gets his own shower and dryer he like just are you cleaning out his litter box I see it's not there right now yeah it's not there right now what him first. Uh -huh. The chicken. Okay. Sorry. What do you want? Do you want something? Are you hungry? Where's he going? What's he? Get out of. Don't go in my room. Don't go in my room. I don't trust you in there. What are you doing? What are you. 10 bucks. 10 bucks? I'm not paying you 10 bucks. I'm going in my room. <laughs> bro. I'm not paying. That's my room, dog. I'm not paying you 10 bucks. I'm going in my room, bro. Come on, bro. Like, like, just quit joking around. Dude, quit joking around. Thanks. Can I go in my room or is it still a $10 cover? I don't care. Oh, Jacob has an adventure. Ooh, where's Jacob leading us? Ooh, Jacob. Oh, we found the taffy. Jacob found the taffy. Oh, close, close, close. Oh, there we go. Ooh, Jacob got, okay. All right, you're being an asshole now. Okay, now you're being a douchebag. Sorry, Dave's loitering I'm really sorry. cool. Dave, do you want attention? No, I'll clean it up. It's all right. It's all right. No, it's all right. Come on, come on. Don't do that. Always making the POC do all the work, eh? I don't, I didn't, I don't have, I don't. I'm sorry. Dave, what are you what are you doing? Do you want attention? Brandy five bucks. Five bucks to get to the other end of my hallway? Is this your new side gig? He's making both of us pay five bucks uh, to Jacob. get to the No. Not Jacob? Yeah. Why not Jacob? Uh, I don't know. No, no, no. We're like this. We're like I'm we're like that too. We're more like that, but what does that mean? I'm bored. <laughs> <laughs> All right, always great content for the video. Now we lived on campus at Fordham for about two years and the food there, guys, I shit you not, was in last place out of all colleges in the country. There was a study, look. So the food we're eating now is pretty good. But hey, you should be the judge of that. Guys, we're in our own apartment now, so we're cooking for ourselves, and yeah. Chef David has come out to play. <laughs> homemade, All right, homemade. Explain the, the dish, Daisy. I bought this, right? Homemade. How much was homemade. it? How much was right. it? Like 250. God. And I cooked it in the microwave. So we got the chicken here with the, the gravy. The gravy has wrinkles in it. Uh, we got the corn. That? We got the corn here. It's okay. a little soupy. And then we have the mashed potatoes. But uh, here, this is the the piece of de resistance, right? <laughs> yeah, I don't think Watch that this was chicken. real French. Watch this chicken. Uh. Dude, when you grab the chicken and brought it back up, it like, it fights and like, <laughs> it like fights the gravy and it's like stuck to it. <laughs> it's, oh my God, structurally unsound. It's That's falling all bread. Apart. It's all bread. There's a little bit of chicken in there. Oh my gosh. Dude. All right. I may have overhyped the meals we were having up here a little bit. They were nothing like what I was cooking at home with my brother. That stuff was addictive. Hey Google, stop. Hi, my name's Mike Fowler. Sorry, and you just- I don't understand. Shut up! Th my name's Mike Fowler, and welcome to my kitchen. So today, we made a little something called Heisenberg Blue. This is good, I'm hooked on this stuff. He knows how to make it, it's killer. We finished the cook. So in about half an hour, that in there will be fully rock solid candy. At that point, we'll crack it and it will fully be made into crystal Heisenberg Blue. Yeah, I have a lot of that, a lot. When's it gonna be ready? Oh, um, probably about 45 minutes. Okay. Yeah, trust me, I'm, I'm gonna be standing here the okay. whole time. Yeah. You know what's crazy? I feel like there are bugs in my skin. Actually, there are a bunch on the wall behind you. Oh my God. Oh my God, there they all are. Mom, me and Mike are doing a joke that we're addicted to meth. Yes. I'm telling you what, this is a Mike call and response. If you want some of my hard candy, comment done on my Instagram. It's gonna be around the bottom here. Jesus Mike Christ. Fowler underscore underscore underscore. Ha, I'm Saul Goodman. Did you know you have rights? Constitution says you do. Guys, comment on Mike's Instagram what show that was a reference Yo, to. Yo, here's a hint. Better call Saul. That was a good hint. You wanna see what else we got that's kind of like meth? Yeah. McDonald's. 
This will kill you faster than meth. Too true. Truth bomb. Mike Fowler, truth bomb! Now, can you believe that Mike is gonna be a freshman at college this year? Even though he didn't ask, I decided to give him a few tips and tricks that I've picked up over the years. Mike, I don't want to stress you out. College is the single most important time of your life, and if you ruin it, you will ruin the entire trajectory of the rest of your life. I'm gonna give you a few tips on college. Number one, one of the most important things you need to know in college, always wear a condom. Always. At all times. Never take it off. <laughs> wear it whenever you're going out, wear it in the shower, wherever you go. Like, where do you like to go? Um, like sheets. <laughs> sheets. <laughs> yeah. The gas station chain. Yeah, and there's one at Penn State. So you like to hang out at a gas station? Yeah, but it's in like the main building. It's called the hub. My second favorite hub. <laughs> First one's porn hub. Yeah, I got that much. One question. How do I get some valid shoddies? I know sometimes you have $500 and you go out to street corners at about 2 a.m. on any Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. They have prostitutes in State College, Pennsylvania? Never been. Wow. <laughs> I am an incredible brother. Anyway, so uh, that's that. That's the episode. I'm gonna make more, I promise. And I'm also gonna be posting some of my stand-up and stuff on here. And guys, I don't wanna jinx anything, but I think we are well on our way to becoming the biggest channel on all of YouTube. So thank you for watching, members of the hashtag Doug Gang still working on a name. Subscribe if you haven't already. And, uh, and I'll see you soon with more videos. Have a good one.